Alright then, let's go wake up this princess. Hey, you're, you know, from the party. So does that mean you're a seed? I'm Squall, the squad leader. There's two others with me. Take it easy. It's just that I'm so happy. I've been sending requests to Garden forever, but nothing. I'm so glad I spoke to Sid directly. Oh. So you were looking for the headmaster at the party? You know Cypher? Yeah. Well, he's the one who introduced me to Sid. Sid is such a nice man. I really didn't think Sid would come out to help a measly little group like us. But after explaining our situation to him, Sid gave the go-ahead right away. Now that you guys are here, we'll be able to carry out all kinds of plans. I'm going back to the others. Okay, let's go. Um, Squall, is he here? Cypher? No, he's not a seed. Oh. Oh yeah, my name's... Rinoa! Very pleased to meet you, Squall. Seed members dance quite well, don't they? Approach your target inconspicuously at a dance party. There may be missions requiring, requiring this sort of subterfuge. It's expected if seeds learn various skills. Oh, so it's work related. That's too bad. I think he was trying to tell a joke. <laughs> Here, let me introduce you. This is a good boy. Named Angelo. Smart, huh? So yeah, her limit break uses Angelo. She literally fires the dog at the enemies <laughs> and then he explodes. I have some important work to do now. I can't not play this game and not do that. <laughs> I have to. It's like a complex that I have. This is Zell. And Selfie. This is a full-scale operation. Our resistance, the Forest Elves, will be forever known in the pages of Tinber's independence. Exciting, huh? It all started when we got hold of top-secret info from Galbadia. There's a VIP from Galbadia coming to Timber. The guy's name is Vinza Delling, our arch-enemy and the president of Galbadia. Vinza Delling is a scoundrel! He's a dictator, not a president. Not even popular in Galbadia, sir. <laughs> president Delling is taking a private train from the Galbadian capital. I'm going to say Galbadia and Galbadia interchangeably, so then everyone gets to yell at me. Our plan is to... Blow into smithereens with a rocket launcher? Uh, not quite. It's way more convoluted than that. First, I'll go over the model. The yellow train on the top right is our base. We're riding in it right now. Right next to it is a dummy car. We made it to look just like the president's car. Their train has three cars. First, there's the locomotive, followed by the first escorts. 
The red car is the president's car. Denning should be inside. The last car is the second escort. So we need to switch the cars out. And then there's like a bunch of sensors and stuff and we have to like press codes in and whatnot. It's really convoluted. Delink hates the company of his guards and being surrounded by sensors and keeps them away from his car. Uncouple the first escort car. We'll have to complete the uncoupling before the first switch point. If we don't, boom! Yeah, so we have to move fast. I'll explain the uncoupling process later. After the car is uncoupled, we'll have the dummy car and our base move in. At this point, our train and their train will be linked and be moving together. Simple as that. <laughs> After that, we'll return to our base and prepare to confront Delling. We have exactly five minutes to complete the procedures. If we fail, our train will collide with theirs at the switch point. It'll be all over. Don't forget that. Five minutes? You sure that's enough? According to the simulation we ran, it should only take three minutes to complete the operation. Piece of cake for seeds, right? Of course. Too easy. Okay, now let's talk about how to avoid the sensors on the second escort. Go ahead, Watts. The guards have a sound sensor and a temperature sensor, sir. Any sound will trigger the sound sensor, so move across very quietly, sir. The blue guard is carrying the sensor. The temperature sensor will go off if you remain stationary, sir. The red guard is carrying this one. That never really comes into it, though, with all sensors. You just run past them anyway. We can't uncouple the cars directly, instead we'll have to tamper with the control system that manages the coupling. If we temporarily disable the circuit for the connection, the car will uncouple automatically. To disable it, we have to enter several codes. Oops. <laughs> one, four, one, four. One, four, one, four. Four, 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 three. Two, four, one, three. You got it? In the real thing, there's a strict time limit leading up to the switch point. Don't forget that. That's all. By the way, this model's nice, but the president's car looks kind of shabby. Why is that? Yeah, Renault made it. That's why. We bought everything else at the gift store. Oh, I thought some kid makes it made it. Paint job sucks too. Seat Squall, he doesn't join in. <laughs> he always thinks these things. Doesn't say them out loud. Oh, shut up! I made it look like that on purpose. It represents my hatred towards Delling. Hatred, eh? Yeah, right. It's one of the ugliest things that I've ever seen in my life. You must really hate him. Are you guys finished? Enough about the model. Can we get on with it now? Yes. Gathering information is my specialty, sir. Oh, my stomach. We're moving again. I'll go take a look. Talk to Watts when you're ready. The sooner the better. Let's go save it.
Let's play a game with Balam's rules and ours. Oh, the same rule. I don't understand the I don't understand the other rules. But yeah, we're gonna play cards first. We've got more important things to worry about, like cards. I don't understand the same rule. Oh, it's closed as well. I hate I hate this part. I'm never a fan of Triple Triad after the rules change. I can't see his cards anymore, which sucks. Really sucks. Pretty sure he's got a card that I want. But we'll never know! You can manipulate the way the card game works to like change the rules, I just don't I don't know off the top of my head how to do it. Yeah, because now I don't know if I if you can do that or not. It's all kinds of awful. <laughs> that's it, Angelo, that's the one I want. Good. I just wanted the Angelo card. That's all I wanted. I can I can leave now. <laughs> we can carry on. I'm ready. Have you seen the dummy of the president, sir? If you haven't, please take a look. See, it's like a piece of art. I know the kidnapping plan must be tough, but best of luck to you, sir. Are you ready, sir? Yes. I love the background, though. It's so good. Like, again, back in the day, this was, like, mind-boggling. We'll catch up with the second escort soon. Let's get ready. We should time our jumps well. After we catch up to them, we save some time. For now, we have exactly five minutes to complete the operation. This is the president's car. After we get across, we'll proceed with the first uncoupling. Sir, so, everything is in order, sir. You again. That's 27 times now. How many more times do you plan to disturb me with this meaningless report? Sir, I'm sorry, sir, but it's my duty, sir. It's hard to believe that anyone would put up with this nonsense. I guess it's none of my business. Dismissed. Sir, yes sir. There goes next month's paycheck. I'm going to propose to her now. I'm going to have to put it off again. This is the first escort. We're going to uncouple this first. Like what said, there should be two guards on this car. Selfie and Zell, you guys keep an eye on the guards. Let us know early if you see them coming. You ready? Three, three, four.
This way! Oh, I haven't been able to move around the FMBs. It was absolutely mind-blowing. And this isn't even the best example of them doing it. There's bits later on which are just insane. I feel like they'd know what's going on though. <laughs> like you'd feel this, right? What should I do? I know he's not gonna like it, but it's my job. S sir, everything is in order, sir. Huh? He's not angry. Phew, that's strange. Oh, he's reading the paper. I wonder where he got it. What? Is there a problem? I'm in a bad mood right now. If there's nothing in particular, I order you to leave immediately. Aye, aye, yes, sir. You, don't just stand there. Get back to your station. There goes another paycheck. That's two in one day. Is this the right train? The interior looks different. Looks shabbier. Maybe not. What am I going to do? No ring. And now no more candlelit dinner. I'm never going to be able to get married. Five codes. Four, two, three, one. One, four, two, one. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> come on. Close. Four, two, three. This way. Just about. <laughs> Just about. Got him. The most convoluted plan in the world. <laughs> but it did it. Finally, we waited so long for this encounter with Vinza. Was that perfect, sir? Amazing, sir. You're the best, sir. I did a good job. Hooray. Well then, leave the intelligence up to me, sir. You three, tell me where you're ready to go. As soon as you're ready, I'll begin serious negotiations with the President. Serious negotiations? <laughs> I better make sure my GFs are quit. I think it is. Oh, it's not equipped. I hate it when it does this. Yeah, every so often it just like takes your junction in off you. It's kind of dumb. Uh, 
That'll do. Yeah, that will do. Let's go save it. You can actually one shot this next boss because it's undead. And you can just use a phoenix down on it and one shot it. <laughs> Which is always fun to do. I'm ready! President Delling, as long as you don't resist, you won't get hurt. And if I do resist, what would you do, young lady? What's wrong? Boo-hoo, too bad. I'm not the president, I'm what they call a body double. All these rumours about the many resistance groups in Timber. You pass along a little false information and they fall for it. How pathetic. Seems like there are only amateurs around here. Amateurs? Ah, my butt hurts from all this sitting young lady. So what did you have in store for me if I had resisted? Why don't you tell me? Quite amusing though for being such amateurs. How dare you insult the president! Zombies! You fell for it! I don't think this will work on him, but we can at least look at it. Can you see what it looks like? We haven't actually seen the animations yet, have we, for these two? Diablos is cool. I really like the animation. I like the animation of all the summons, to be honest. They're really good. Particularly like that one. Amusing. This is amusing. Kill the resistance. Siren just put silence on things, if I remember correctly. So it won't really work on him, but. It does do damage. Cool. Punch him, Zal! Punch him! Don't let him munch on your head. Punch him! Hooray! And Squawk can just one shot him. Blog! Can just use a Phoenix down on him as well, like I said. I'm not gonna waste a Phoenix down on him though. Roger oh Right, what are we drawing from him? What's he got? Berserk's probably pretty useful. What else has he got? Oh, he put zombie on you, doesn't he? Or curse, or whatever it is. So you can't use your limit breaks. Can you draw when you have silence? I don't remember. I don't think you can. Oh, that's annoying. Mwah! <laughs> don't kill Zell. How oh, slow. Let's 
gotta keep people alive while we stock up on berserks and whatnot. This will keep us going for a while. Sell. We're gonna get a hundred zombies at this rate. Well, to be fair, the way it's, eventually I'm gonna have, I'm gonna be able to just stop doing all of this. It's been a while yet, but. why I'm doing it with zombie to be honest. I'm never gonna use it. Or Berserk to be honest. I'm never gonna use that either. Just a habit really. Oh that's not gonna end well for you is it? I thought she had more, did more damage than that. How much damage did that do? I locked away. <laughs> One shot him. What is this? Oh, that's a lot of damage. He's dead. Hooray! President was a fake. Can't believe we fell for it. Info, sir! New info! It's big news! I found out the real reason why the President's here, sir. The President's going to the TV station. Security's super tight, sir. The TV station? Why in Timber? They can broadcast just as easily from Galbadia. Do you think the delay communication tower had anything to do with this? I mean, probably. What's that? Dolly has a communication tower that can transmit and receive radio waves. It had been abandoned for a long time, but the Gabardian army got it up and running yesterday. The only TV station that can handle broadcasts over the air is in Timber. Other stations use HD cable, which only supports online broadcasting. So what's that supposed to mean? They're planning on using radio waves. This way, they can transmit images to other regions without cable. I know that. What I want to know is why is the why is the president going to broadcast? Why use radio waves? There must be something they want to say to the whole world. What can it be? 
Yeah, I doubt that. <laughs> Unlikely. If I remember correctly, radio waves haven't been used in 17 years. It's been that long? Wouldn't it be wonderful if the first broadcast could be the Declaration of Timber's Independence? That might be possible. Let's come up with a plan then. Yeah, they're not overly organised. <laughs> Can you guys give us a minute? That's how you discard, I remember. Sort this magic out as well. She almost got some full zombies. I think I can do it through this to be honest, but she's life refined. Yeah, easy. I thought I gave her all those regens, apparently not. Go, that's better. Hundred percent zombie, why not? <laughs> if I do that then I can just like use Phoenix Downs on enemies and it'll kill them. Right, I want to berserk on you, but I don't remember why. You have a hundred doubles? That I did not know. We don't have Kiraga's equipped anymore, right? Like junction to anything? Nope. Cool. Oh, good timing. We've come up with a plan. <laughs> the face palm. Before we get into that, can I see your contract with our garden? Oh, sure. What's it say? Balam Garden, hereafter referred to as Party A, acknowledges the Forest Owls, hereafter referred to as Party B, as the hiring party. Seed, hereafter referred to as Party C, shall be dispatched upon signing of the contract. Party, shall, party C shall operate under the supervision. The hell? I don't get it. Oh yeah, that one's pretty confusing. When I told him I didn't understand, he gave me a different one. Sid is such a nice man. What's it say this time? The seed deployment contract will last until Chitimber achieves independence. Please make good use of each seed member. I wish you the best of your objective. Please understand this contract is an exception and no replacement of any seed members can be made. So we're stuck with them <laughs> until Chitimber's independence? That's so vague! Hey, you're paid professionals! No complaining! Okay, let's decide on the parties! 
Gathering information is my specialty, sir. So, the four of us, the ones I'll be heading to the TV station, will be... Do you have to come? Oh, you have to come. Okay. Sorry, Zell. I think Renoa has a higher base magic stat than Selfie does. If I remember correctly, she has 84. I'm pretty sure Renoa has a higher base magic stat than Selfie would, so that will do for now. Follow me anytime. We're going with the ladies. <laughs> I never use selfie, so I'm gonna start using it more. I'm ready, let's go. We need to get to the TV station. A guy dressed as a cadet gathering information. He was asking about the president's stay. I found it strange that a cadet would keep asking about the president. He was very polite and kept addressing me as sir. I think I know who you're talking about. He was taking care of three suspicious looking characters from Bala. I'll go question every teenager in the area. No, no, we can't just go up to anybody and... These are citizens, we can't inflict any... How dare they try to kidnap the president! Not only is it disrespectful to the president, but also to us as Galbadian soldiers as well. I'll be sure to find them and throw their sad behinds in jail! Please, <laughs> hear me out to the very end. So yeah, essentially, there was a war 18 years ago. Timber lost that war, and now they're occupied by, Gal by, Galbadian, by the Galbadian army. This dumbass group here, the Timberals, they're fighting for independence, and now we're stuck with them <laughs> till they get independence. I think the TV station is located behind a building called Timber Maniacs. Please head in that direction, sir. I hope you can find it. Seems like the hotel's not a very believer. Should you need to recover, use the owl's tear, sir. Find it the old man's house. Hey! <laughs> Don't leave me, sir! So we unlock Renoa's Limit Breaks through these magazines called Pet Pals. Welcome to Pet Pals! Your dog learns a, learns a trick, trick to damage enemies in this issue. Angelo, strike! I think you unlock them through... Yeah, you have to click it and then it's based on the number of steps you take, like you're walking the dog. Look at him! He's just so cute! My parents got me Georgie at this pet shop! Georgie! You are very cute! Well, I'm out of money. <laughs> Is there anything I can sell? I'll never use those, it's fine. Invincible Moon! That one's pretty powerful. Angelo Reverse! Also pretty good. I normally use Renoa, so I'm not going to, I don't think. I think I'm going to use Quistus and Selfie in this playthrough. Well, that's Timber Maniacs, but let us... 
let's explore. Let's explore the town a little. Looks like the trains have stopped running. Usually the local trains would be running here. A lot of hustle and bustle. Get his maverick. Let's fucking get her. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Achoo! I'm allergic to cats. My daughter loves them. What am I to do? Kitties everywhere. It's so cute. Some really mean looking guy was looking for you, but are you... They're good people. I do like cats. I'm a big fan of cats. Better keep your eyes peeled. If you let one resistance member in here, your dear kids are, well, dead meat. We have to get to the TV station fast. I can't bear to watch them suffer like this. Can we just kill them? <laughs> you guys are such fools. Just imagine how much this place would thrive if you were loyal to us. This place is going to be stuck in the backwoods forever. And you? Are you happy with your life? Blindly following orders every day, doing things you probably don't believe in? So what if we're underdeveloped? We're not looking to thrive. All we want is to be able to stand on our own feet, to be independent, and live according to what we believe. You guys will probably never understand, having thrown away your pride and dignity. We're not the fools. You are. You're both dead. I, I beg to differ. <laughs> I don't think they are, friends. Angelo Kenna <laughs> Look at this. It's so dumb. Bah! <laughs> but it's okay, he's fine. I didn't want stupid experience points. We appreciate your help, but we can't let you through here. I'm sorry. I'll be back later then. Looking for Timber Maniacs? It's right here. Where's the TV station? Yeah, that's in this town. Do you want to know more about it? Maybe the lady next door would know. Girl next door! That's <laughs> what you think it is. Naughty magazine! This is what I actually came here for. Oh man, why do the Battle Series books sell so well? We're sure living in a terrible age. Oh, you're looking around? Anything you want to know? Recently, I had a strange dream that I became a Galbadian soldier named Laguna. Actually, it was too realistic to be just a dream. My friends had a similar experience too. Yeah, dreams are really strange. This morning I dreamt that... Why did I bring this up? <laughs> I won't shut up about his dreams. This morning's dream, yesterday's dream, childhood dreams. Big mistake. <laughs> hey guys! Word of advice, you're still young. Don't let your life pass you by. Ouch. Ouch. 
I hurt my stomach a bit by saying that. The Zaga, just right there, slaying around. <laughs> I guess it's quite hidden now. You guys watch yourselves. Some seedy looking guys were heading towards the pub. The pub is downstairs. I think I smell blood. I hope it's just my imagination. Are we on a date, you ask? Does it look like we are? We're on patrol to keep the peace in the town. Mountain? Forest? Timber was named for its rich vegetation. It used to be that we were surrounded by this beautiful forest. For a country bumpkin, he sure had some good stuff. Yo, better ease off a little. These timber hicks hate us enough as it is. Let's get him! Wow, 75! I forgot I haven't got a free junction to a magic cap I? I can do that too! Rather than just one-shotting everything with Squall, I'm just like messing around. <laughs> one-shotting the other two characters instead. Oh no, I leveled up! No! I got a Buell card. I got better cards than that shit. Four tenths. There are no trains to the desert today. I've had enough of this city. I came from Delay to have a good time and now... Trains are no longer running. Can't even stay in a hotel because of some stupid official. I harassed by Galbadian soldiers. Had my precious card stolen. This hasn't been my day. Those jerks. I think they can use brute force to get anything they want. Hell, this town's a good example. Yeah. Everything's jacked up because the Resistance tried to kidnap the President. Thanks to them, the trains have stopped. There's Galbadian soldiers all over the place, all because of them. Don't they understand I'm the one suffering for their reckless actions? Stupid, boneheaded, good-for-nothing Resistance, you can just kiss my... Hey! You don't understand anything. The Resistance is fighting for Timber's future. They're doing the best they can. It's the Galbadian soldiers and their leader who are at fault. Gonna go through the back alley. Might be a little difficult right now. He's being pretty stubborn. The guy throws a fit when you try and move him from that spot. We need to get through. Jeez, and I'm getting dissed by some punk. Oh no, give me another drink. Let's have your card back. Huh? It is! Why do you have it? Found it outside? Are you serious? Okay. Thanks, know what? I'm feeling generous, you can keep that card. And also this one. I'll move out of the way now. Thanks for the shitty cards. cat. Hello. Uh, oh, I feel sick. I drank too much. Ah, giant children!
We the resistance carried out the kidnapping of the president. <laughs> Kitty cats everywhere. Anyway, here's the TV station. So if you look really carefully at that static, you might notice something. Just, just, just stare at it. Just look really carefully into it. I never even, I never noticed this until like the HD remaster. So the game does do a really shitty job of explaining its like mysteries and backstories, or at least at least some of them, like the more background elements. A lot of the world building in this game, like I've said, it's done like Dark Souls style, where you pick up stuff from the environment, from logs. It's, an act it's actually a really fascinating world with a lot of interesting history, you just have to dig for it. And like a lot of the games, outside knowledge helps too. Each Final Fantasy actually has a guidebook that got released for it called The Ultimania. A really great books full of trivia and lore, lots of concept art and interviews. And they explain a lot of the world and the history in each game. They they really do a lot to improve your understanding of what's going on and obviously I'd recommend it to anyone that's interested in these stories. I just wish they'd find a way to better explain a lot of the stuff in the game. It's not so much a problem of here but say for example in, in Final Fantasy X when we get to that one eventually there's a lot of really vital information missing that paints the full picture of what's going on and it's missing from the game but it's all in the Ultimania. It's actually become kind of a staple of Tase and his, and his team's games, those being 8, 10 and the 13 trilogy. They all have the same kind of storytelling style, that is, stuff that's hidden away in logs. So, this TV broadcast that's about to happen, it's a really big deal because obviously Estar went dark 17 years ago and at the same time this radio interference engulfed the planet and they haven't been able to use radio waves to communicate since. Like in this world there's a lot of radio interference and it's coming from somewhere and that part doesn't need spoiling yet but this TV static it's a bit of foreshadowing because it has messages in it that you may have already picked out by this point. It says I'll never let you forget me and I am here bring me back there which is it's kind of chilling when you notice it I'll never let you forget me and we'll find out why why this is in the static much much later on in the game hey an outdoor TV this is creepy what is it this noise is broadcast over most of the most of the frequencies Something has to be done about this before they can broadcast it over the air. The president in the studio now, sir. Too many guards now, so we won't be able to storm the place, sir. Alright, thanks for that. <laughs> so we can't just rush in. We've got to come up with a new plan now. If the president leaves, maybe the guards will be gone too. That's when we do our broadcast. It might not be as influential, but it's better than nothing, right? We don't stand a chance if you take them head on, right? Don't worry about us. We'll fight your enemies based on your decision. That's our duty. Hey, I'm a C2. Just want you to know I'm ready for anything. How sad. Act on my decision. That's your duty. Oh, what an easy life it must be just to follow orders. Bitch. Call it what you want. All we want is for you to achieve your goal using our help. I find it hard to believe that you can do it, though. What did you say? If you have something to say, just say it. So people always say that Squall's being a dick in this scene, but he, I don't think he is. Like, I think Renault was, like, completely out of order. 
exactly what she's doing and she's about to learn some home truths. How serious are you, really? The three of you just plop down onto the floor to discuss strategy. On top of that, you can't make a decision without our input, right? How do you think we feel working for such an organisation? You're being a little too hard. Sorry. Guess I got a little carried away. You know... Maybe this was all a big mistake. I thought everything would work out fine once Seed came to help us. But I guess it's not that easy. You're all hired. It's not like you're one of us. Well, let's see. We'll cancel the plan and we'll disperse for now. We don't stand a chance if we take him head on, right? So you guys probably think this is all a game to us? Well, it's not. We're serious. So serious, it hurts. They're starting? Testing, one, two, testing, testing. Oh. But people of the world, can you see me? Can you hear me? Oh, this is incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a recording. This is an actual broadcast over the air. Yes, it's been 17 years since a live broadcast has been possible. Oh, please excuse me. I seem to have lost my composure. We would like to present to you today a message from the lifelong president of Galbadia, Vinza Delling. Ladies and gentlemen, President Delling. Greetings, I am Vinza Delling. Lifelong president of Galbadia, today I stand before you to make the following proposition. We, the people of this world, have the power to end all wars. See, see, it's a peace proposal to the world. I knew it. Unfortunately, there are some trifling problems standing between Galbadia and the other nations, and they must be resolved. I plan to convene with the other nations' leaders immediately to resolve these problems. At this time, allow me to introduce the Ambassador, who will be my representative for the conference. Man, all this is to introduce an Ambassador. The Ambassador is the Sorceress. The Sorceress? Cypher? What's he doing? Stay back. Squall, what are we going to do? For the last time, stay back. You're only going to provoke him. Nothing. Our job is to assist the owls. It's none of our business. Timber team, are you watching? Get over here right now. You have permission. I need your help. Let's go! I don't think we actually have a fight, but let's just... to restrain him what do you think you're doing it's obvious ain't it what are you planning to do with this guy 
planning to do? That's right. He knows Renoa. Is that why he's here? I get it. You're Renoa's. Shut your damn mouth, chicken wuss. He broke out of the disciplinary room, injuring many in the process. You stupid idiot! Cell, please. Be quiet. Instructor, I know. You're not going to take this stupid idiot back to garden, right? Shut up, no! Oh, Zell, you stupid moron! <laughs> I see. So you're all from garden. Should anything happen to me, the entire Galbadian army will be undoubtedly crushed, garden. You can let go of me now. Nice going, chicken wuss. You and your stupid big mouth. Take care of this mess, instructor and Mr. Leader. Poor, poor boy. This is a pretty good, good theme as well. <laughs> the sorceress music is great. Stay away from me. Such a confused little boy. Are you going to step forward, retreat? You have to decide. Stay back. The boy in you is telling you to come. The adult in you is telling you to back off. You can't make up your mind. You don't know the right answer. You want to help, don't you? You want to be saved from this predicament. Don't be ashamed to ask for help. Besides, you're only a little boy. I'm not. Stop calling me a boy. You don't want to be a boy anymore? I am not a boy! Come with me to a place of no return. Bid farewell to your childhood. Hey guys! Where's Cypher? We don't know. He'll be okay, right? I'll keep an eye out for you. Go on, you should get back to town. We found our base, it's completely destroyed. And everyone else? They're fine, they're good at escaping. We have to stay away from Timber for a while. Is there a safe place you can take me? 
This is an order. An order from your client, remember? All right. Renoa, I heard your base is in serious trouble. Come over to my place until things settle down. I appreciate it, thank you. What are you waiting for, Squall? Come on. way. I'll let you know if anything changes. Till then, make yourself at home. Thanks, Chief. Chief? She's the leader of the Forest Foxes. Almost everyone's a resistance member in this town. But right now, we're the only ones that are really active. Stay here for a while. I still don't get it. What did Cypher come here for? I think he came to help us, the forest owls. I talked about it a lot with him. So please, don't think too badly of him. Anybody in here? What is this? I have two small children in here. Don't do anything to frighten them. Upstairs, hurry. Will she be okay? She'll be fine. The legend goes that my mother took down many soldiers with her strength cooking and beauty. That beauty, sh <laughs> beauty part sure makes it sound like a legend. Oof. I was so angry when they found out it was only the three of you dispatched Simba. What? They made up fighting the whole Galbadian force. And all the dispatch of three rookie seed members? Damn it, I'm going to Timber. I never would have guessed he was serious about it. The guy's always serious, you should know that by now. So tired. If he's all right. What's going to happen to Cypher? He may already be dead. How can you be so casual? I feel sorry for him. You feel sorry? Cypher would hate to hear that. What's so funny? You're terrible. So why do you think Cypher may already be dead? Because... The president of Galbadia and the sorceress joined forces. Cypher attacked the president. It's no surprise that Cypher may have been killed because of it. Even so, I still hope he's alive. I mean, Renoa seems to like Cypher, so, you know, we are just kind of seeing him again through Squall's perspective, aren't we? Reality isn't so kind, everything doesn't work out the way you want it to, that's why. As long as you don't get your hopes up, you can take anything. You feel less pain. Oh, relatable. <laughs> anyway, whatever wish you have is none of my business. You're mean. Meanie! What's with her? Sorry. The Galbadian forces are withdrawing. 
only the soldiers normally stationed here will stick around. If you're going to leave town, now's your chance. You know how persistent those soldiers can be. Kitty cat. Like everyone's tired. Any thoughts on where to go? I have to get out of here first. Getting out of here is only the first step. What do you mean? Garden code, Article 8, Line 7. Eight, seven. In the event that returning to the assigned garden is not possible, report to the nearest garden. Head for the nearest garden. Very good. From here that will be Galbadia Garden. We can take the train from here and get off at the station called East Academy. From there, we have to go through the forest west of the station to get to Galbadia Garden. I've been there several times, we should be okay. Okay then. We'll escape from Timber and head to Galbadia Garden. The party will be... That. Let's go. You be careful now. Take this with you. Bad timing! It's me, sir! It's me! Got some info, sir! Timber Station will be shut down temporarily! Mega bummer! Not necessarily! It's not completely shut down yet! The last train out of here is bound for East Academy! We're getting on that train! You're going too, right, Ranoa? Yeah, what about you, Watts? No need to worry about me! I'll go gather more info! I promise I'll be back. You take care, okay? Yeah, don't worry. Client's orders. What about you? Will you be safe here? I'll be fine, sir. I'll put up the fight of my life. to go to East Academy, right? There's no more tickets left. We'll do whatever it takes to get on that train. You won't have to do that. Looky here, I have everyone's tickets right here. One for you. Three for you see people. Here, I'll give them to the leader. And the last one is for me. Go on, take it. I can't take that, it's yours. Just get going, the train's leaving. Thank you. Zone, we're going to see each other again, okay? No matter what, you have to survive. We have to liberate Timber together, remember? I know, I know. I'll go hide in a bathroom or something. I'll get going. Won't open. Say, young lad, what on earth are you doing? <laughs> Robbing your home. Do you like beverages? Yeah. Drink all you want from the faucet. You don't have to hold back, it's just water. Uh, 
Oh, is it good? Yeah, it heals you. <laughs> Get on the train! Let me double check. Get off at East Academy and go through the forest west of the station. Galbadia Gardens is located up ahead, is that correct? Indeed. Glad we have a leader of a good memory. This train, bound for East Academy, will depart shortly. We'll... Make it... Open up! Better never have a way. We should get there shortly, so we'll be all right out here. Yeah, you should feel bad, to be honest. <laughs> oh man. Weren't you just saying something? It's nothing important, but... Well, we made it. I have to thank Zone for that. He's into naughty magazines. <laughs> Keep that in mind. I love trains. <laughs> she sure likes trains. Well, what's the matter? No time even to rest, really. Yes, I will definitely be getting off. <laughs> Otherwise you end up... You don't even know where you end up. So we're over here now. Got Galbadia Garden, that's where we're heading. I got Timber, which we're quite far away from now. And Delay. I think that's where the train ends up. It goes to Delay. Which at some point we will head over there. At some point soon, actually. For now, though. We're not too far from Galbadia Garden now. Hey, I was just thinking. There might be some bad news from the Galbadian government. What if we get caught and get broadcast to the whole world? Whatever happens, happens. Now come on, let's just keep going. I, I'm worried about Balam Garden. If anything happens to Garden, it's all my fault. I'm the one who said we're all from Garden. You think the President will retaliate on Garden? Maybe. Because... But we have a whole bunch of seeds at Balam Garden. They wouldn't just lose to the Galbadian army, would they? Depends how strong the army is. I know, but... Oh, you're just a great leader, aren't you? Do you actually have fun acting so callous towards your comrades? Not again. Zell wants your support. I knew it was going to be something like that. Any kind of encouragement will make. That's just to ease your mind. Am I the only one who thinks that? No, I'm sure Cypher... Don't you ever worry about or even think about the well-being of your comrades? 
I don't believe in relying on others. Don't you understand? Are you listening, Squall? What the... the sensation? going on? I think they went to the dream world. Here, are you sure this is the place? Positive. I don't want to be trolling, patrolling the wrong place like last time. Uh, sorry, this ain't the place. This is it. Let's go, Commander. I bought the wrong map. Somehow, I have a bad feeling about this. Seriously, I have a bad feeling. There's something fishy going on here. You know what the old folks say? The unfamiliar always happens. You mean unexpected, right? You only got the un part right. Ah, shut up. <laughs> Stop your clamouring and make sure all your gear's equipped. Now let's move out. Pretty sure all my gear's equipped. Nice. Let's go. But seriously, this place sure is strange. What the heck is this big pile of rocks? You think these are natural rocks used for carving tombstones? Who knows? Or cares? <laughs> Speaking of strange, why have you been running around so strange? Strange? What do you mean strange? Just being cautious. That's the basic rule of... Hey! Looks like we got company. Esthar soldiers. Still wearing those flashy uniforms. Don't be such a weenie. What the? Wasn't our mission just to patrol? Why does it have to turn out like this? Seriously, I wasn't expecting this at all. More coming. There's no end to this. Better make a run for it. Breaks, blinds, bios, zerks, silences, confuses. 
Pains. Pains are pretty good. Meltdown. Bio. Bio. I thought I got drained from that, but I guess not. I don't actually remember the way around here, to be honest. <laughs> Something stupid again, I bet. You guys are going to regret saying that. They say, one who makes fun of a genius will end up crying in the end. So who's the genius? <laughs> Shut up. Anyway, the lever for this hatch is broken. So if we just loosen it a bit more. When they come after us from that side and... Yes! You guessed it. They walk out of it without expecting a thing. And all of a sudden, whoops, and down they go. I have to admit, I really am a genius. <laughs> ah, looks like this file folder is really going to fall for this trap. We won't know until we try, and those who never try will never know. So I'm going to do it. Just remember, if we tamper with the lever, we won't be able to make it back to the other side. It'd be idiotic to fall for our own trap. There. I really like Laguna. I wish he was the main character. Yeah, this place where we are, it becomes very relevant much later on in the plot. Like, very relevant. I think it's this way. What the heck is this? A blue and red switch and two fuses? Detonator, you know. Oh, I get it. The short blue fuses for that boulder, and the long red fuses for the boulder further down. Hey man, are you crazy? I don't even know how powerful that thing will be. Ah, uh, but it's not all that. The detonator's right here, so as long as we stay behind, it'll be alright. Let's see. The bomb blast won't reach us here, just stay put. That was awfully loud. Lucky we were here. Wasn't that me who said that? Uh, anyway, we're still alive, right? It's gonna blow! Run for it! was awfully quiet. I was expecting a blast of some sort. See, I told you. I told you it wasn't all that powerful. <laughs> Make your mind up, man. That's actually the way out, but what's over here? Or is this the way out? I don't remember. It's been a while since I last played it. I think this is the way out. Yep, this is the way. Don't tell me. Of all the worst possible predicaments. 
I shouldn't have to fight too many of them though because I blocked off some of the exits. Oh, Blizzara, look at you being all fancy. Back is itchy. Yeah, I normally have to fight a lot more of those <laughs> when you don't do all the puzzle bits. Look, the ocean was saved. Lady Luck is on our side. We can escape to Galbadia. One would say we've been run down. That's what they'd normally say. Don't say that. It might come true. Didn't your grandmother tell you that? You say something bad, it'll come true. Yeah, I think she did. What did you say? I think his throat was injured. He lost his voice. It was fun, you... Say again? It was fun, you guys. Laguna, Kiros, it was fun. Well, that's way uncool. It's not cool to say things like that. Just for that, you're getting the coochie coochie treatment. How's that, huh? Want more? Well. Check it out, a boat. We're getting on. A vessel, they normally call it. Boat, vessel, whatever. We're going back to Galbadia. <laughs> you guys know how high this cliff is? It's amazing. <laughs> he throws them off and he's like, man, you guys sure have guts. <laughs> Yoshino Ikitase has such a wonderful sense of humor. I've been reading about him. He became the... He actually became the main scenario writer in 5. And since then, all of the games have had these funny little moments. I think that I think we can possibly attribute that to him. Because we all remember 5, right? <laughs> With x -Death. Ah! And he broke his leg. Was it Laguna again? Sir Laguna's in big trouble. I hope he'll be okay. Doesn't seem like the first time for you all. What is this? That's the third or fourth mystery. If it were just me, I could tell all the others it was only a crazy dream. We'll just be wasting our time trying to figure it out. Let's keep going. Yeah, let's go. I think we're almost there. Um, Squall? I think I may have said too much. I'm sorry. Okay, we'll give it a save. Oh, well, we'll use a tent first. <laughs> and then we'll give it a save. Because we're going to do a bit of farming now. I don't think it'll be for too long. We can now farm in this part of the in the forest. Just this bit here. These guys. Right, these drop dragon fangs. I need four of them, I think. I should have equipped card, really. Either way, they drop dragon fangs. And this is what I had to stay low level for.
I need to card them, really. Because you get a lot of experience from them. And I gotta stay below level 20. I need four of those. I think it's four. <laughs> it's what I need. I'm just gonna quickly... Yeah, four. Okay. Harding them just so I don't get experience. At least until I get four of them. I'm pretty sure once I get these four dragon fangs, that's it. I don't have to worry about keeping my levels low anymore. I'm pretty sure. I got two dragon fangs. It, it's quite a good drop rate. This is why I kept the level low, because if I didn't, they wouldn't drop dragon fangs anymore. Because again, right, the the enemies level up with you. So if I was like say level thirty now, which I would be if I was leveling up with all the grinding that I've done, I'd probably be like level thirty, forty by now, something like that. They wouldn't drop these dragon fangs anymore, so I wouldn't be able to get the dragon fangs that I need for Squall's ultimate weapon. That's why I've been doing it. <laughs> right away from these. What's this? Oh shit, no, run away! <laughs> Floats are useful, but... Not with... Not with Berserk. Oh, be careful! Because they don't always drop them. That's why I gotta be careful. How many do I have? Two. That's probably safer doing it this way. Two, even better. So now I no longer need to worry about my levels. I can actually level up and play the game properly. <laughs> Hooray! No more level restrictions. So there's somewhere else I need to go to. I think it's like over here. Let's quickly look. So there's Galbadia Garden, I'm not going to go there yet. That's next episode for sure. But I don't think I can get to... This is our duty! I don't think I can do it yet. I need to get to... I need to look for Delling City. There's Timber. The dollar is over. I can't get to Delling City yet, so I can't quite do what I wanted to do yet. We can 
go to Dolly. She's around here somewhere. Down here, I think. Here it is. Albedia Garden? Well, you're in Dolly now. Not quite there yet. You can see from the outskirts of town, but it's kind of difficult to get there. I'm renting a car from you. I refuse! I love the ocean! I don't think there's anything to do in Delay just yet. You can see the aftermath of... <laughs> stupid! There yeah, you're all dead! Oh. Oh, that's... that's... <sighs> so much for that, now I'm sad again. Let's just leave. <laughs> We're getting very close to Squall's final weapon, though. I need to fight some Adamantoises. I need one... I need one adamantine. I think you fight them on the beach, but I think you fight them on the beach later on, not here. Oh, I can kill these now, can't I? I can finally level up! <laughs> I don't know if the Adamantoises are here or not. I don't think they are. You do fight them on beaches, but... Not this beach, though, I don't think. I always thought you did. I didn't think you had to get to Galbadia Garden just yet. To get to the Adamantoises. Oh, there, here they are. They can do that, though. Very hard to kill, that's the problem. This isn't working. What about if I do this? Uh. This will do it. Problem is, it's a very low drop rate. And I did not get lucky. But we'll do this for a little bit. There is another way to get it as well, but this is sooner. Oh, stop it. I don't want to dick around with you.
I think it's like a 4% drop chance, so could take a while. It takes forever, I'll just speed the video up. Oh, damn it. Come on, drop it! Just be nice! Be nice to me, game! So I'm learning some more abilities. Now, if I grind to level 30, I believe it becomes like a 100% drop chance <laughs> from these guys, but... That's not what I want! <laughs> it's not what I want! I want an adamantine! Who has Shiva? Is it you? It's you. Self, you have a hundred protects. Can you give that to Quistis? Oh, she does, but she has some junction to her vitality. Okay, never mind. We'll get there eventually. Might just take a little bit.
I'd say at least I'm getting lots of turtle shells, but I don't think I need turtle shells for anything anymore. Nope. Oh, I do have time magic fine though, don't I? I can get lots of hastes. Lots of quakes too. that does for strength. I don't think... I don't think Quake is quite as good. No. As either of those. Protect will do. Oh, actually, if I give Quake to her... I give... What about if I give Quake to you? Nice, there we go. Super magic! I had a better idea, what if I give it to Quistus? <laughs> Magic, selfie... But he has 100 deaths. Do I have anything I can give to you which will be good for... Doesn't look like it. Yes, we'll do for now. Please, come on! I don't want to be doing this all night, I gotta go to bed soon! Oh wait, I just realised I can't do this. I need to be level 20. I've just been wasting time. <laughs> they don't drop them until you're level frickin' 20, do they? I remember now.
I'd have to grind to level 20 first if I wanted to get his ultimate weapon now. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. There's a, there's a different way to get it anyway. It's a worse way. I have to refine like a really powerful card to be able to do it. But it's a way nonetheless. But we can call the episode there, I think. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye-bye!